Good morning, you guys. It's really early in the morning. It's like seven o'clock, but welcome home. You're here on the Carla Ginger Family Channel. We had something weird going on last night. Something was underneath the floorboards of the house, like down in the crawl space, and we heard something thump or bang around, and it woke us up. And we thought maybe because we're like doing some remodeling and we're having our whole back patio done, like all the way out to the swimming pool, but that definitely wasn't it. So it looks like even though it's really early in the morning, we're going back down in the crawl space to investigate because every day's a new day. Let's make it an awesome one. And the gauge went down last time, and so, so I you're think saying it's my turn. Ginger if it needs to have a little look down. Bring it. Okay, I'm gonna go down. You're gonna hop in yeah, there? Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Okay. This is pretty crazy, guys. I don't know. Oh, ouch! Oh man, what was that? Ow, I just hit my elbow on something. All right guys, here's the situation. I'm letting the family wake up. I went ahead and got ready and I came outside and the sun's come up. I let a little bit of time pass and I wanted to explain what's going on here. We've been doing a lot of remodeling out here on our back patio and we've been pulling up all this old beat up red brick and we've been putting down this travertine and it looks really nice. We've got all these tiles laid out here and they're almost done. It looks really good here. We'll let the lighting adjust here and we're gonna have steps going in and out and a bench and all that and it's all coming together and it's gonna look amazing. But very very recently we had to send Gage up to explore this part of the house that we're remodeling because it was open into the attic and we had to go up there and we also explored down in the crawl space because something was running around down there. So we actually went down in the crawl space underneath the house and well here I'll just show you some highlights of what happened in that video. Whoa guys check this out. You okay? Yeah. It's a little bit freaky down here. It's a little bit spooky. What was that? Oh my gosh. What did you see? I saw something run. So we found some weird eggs in our swimming pool. There's critters that run around and hatched out of the eggs in the bushes last time that the sharers were here at our house. We went down in the crawl space and we heard something really weird running around down there. And then I thought that all of this was resolved because recently Carter Sharer found a huge alligator monster thing in his pond and we thought that it was all resolved and that everything was over, but something happened last night. So when Ginger and I were in bed asleep last night, really early in the morning, like three o'clock in the morning, we hear something underneath the floorboards, underneath the bed go boom, boom, boom. And it like thumped on the floor up underneath the bed and it woke us both up and we got up early and that's kind of where we're at right now. What about you Gage, did you hear anything? Your bedroom is downstairs. No, I didn't hear anything. Do we have to go in, into the crawl space again? We might have to go down in the crawl space, uh. but I think maybe we'll have mom go down there this time. I think she'll fit down the hatch okay. and she'll okay. be able to look around. <sighs> it seems like there's no other way around this. We're gonna have to go back in the crawl space, so it's time to get ready. We'll get some flashlights, some equipment, and we're gonna check out and see what's in there. What do you think, Ginger? Did you get any sleep last night? No, there was something banging on the floor, right? Like Did three o'clock in the morning, like at 3 a.m. We hear bang, 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 like yeah. on the floorboards, right? It felt so, like it was like right under us. Right, so there's only like one solution and Gage went down last time and so, so I you're think saying it's my turn. Ginger if it needs to have a little look down. Bring it. Space. You know what, as long as nothing jumps out at me, I'll be fine. Well, That's what I'm just hoping. Well, there's only one know. way to find out, let's go. Ugh. Well, there's no other way around this. We just have to go in the hatch and go down and see what's in there, right? I'd be lying if I didn't say I wasn't nervous because I just, I am pretty, very nervous. Did that even make time. sense? Yeah, well, you've got sense? a flashlight. Gage used that last time he searched down the crawl space. But yeah, we were sleeping in bed and underneath the floorboards, it was just like bang, bang. So anyway, the uh, crawl space opening is in here. In this closet. In the shoe okay. closet. See I mean, if you can remember is... how to get this open. Okay. Yeah, there's the carpet. Like carpet. Oh my gosh. And then the padding. Careful. Whoa. Careful, careful. Whoa. That's really dark down there. Is it really? Yes. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh my goodness. Okay, okay. wait a second. <laughs> that looks so gross. I'm going down there? Yeah. Okay, wait, let's be quiet. Let's see if we hear anything first. I don't hear anything. Okay, I'm gonna go down. You're gonna hop in there? Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Okay, I'm gonna go check on the kids and make sure they're okay real quick. Do you okay. gather your senses? I'll, and... I'll gather myself and get ready. Okay, here we go. You guys, uh, smash that like button and give Ginger good luck. Look! What's you guys doing okay down there? Yeah, I'm yeah. doing good. Mom's gonna go down in the crawl space, so you guys might want to come out here and see what's Ooh, going on. Okay, let's go. Where's Kyle? Kyle! Hey Kyle. Yeah. Why don't you stay down there and keep an eye on Blue? Oh, okay. maybe we better shut this gate. Yeah. You stay down there, and we'll come check on you in a minute. Okay? Okay. Come keep on. an eye on the dog. 
What do you think, Ginger? I think it looks really scary. <laughs> so far, so good. Uh, yeah. Gage, do you have any advice for me? Like, don't bump your head. And uh, don't put your hand anywhere that you haven't looked, because that. Be That's like... actually really good advice. Yeah, okay. Don't okay. put your hand anywhere that you haven't looked yet. Oh my okay. Gosh. Would you guys actually go down there if this was you? Like, come on now. Well, we well Gage out will. What was, but we haven't okay. heard anything it's at all. Fine. It seems pretty quiet. Okay, go for it. Okay, here we go. Good luck, Ginger. Oh, there's lots of spiders. What? Ooh, okay. like, like spider webs. Here you okay. guys go. You're okay. gonna go down on an adventure with ah. Ginger. Good luck. Here we go. How's it look down there? Um, still just creepy. Okay, you guys. Let's see what we can find. I don't see anything yet, but anything could be down here. You know, there could be something hidden down here that I don't see just because there's a lot of blocks of wood and like there's lots of insulation. I'm checking it out though. One thing that's a little weird is that I know Gage has been down here. There's actually a lot of markings in the dirt that make it look like somebody has been down here. See that footprint? That does not match any of Gage's shoes. Okay, you guys, behind me is where the bathtub is, and that's where I just looked, where you saw all that construction stuff. And I don't think there's anything out there, but this is going the other direction, which is just under the bed. I think this is where the sound was coming from, but I'm just not sure. Here we are. This is right under the bed, and you can see that the dirt is piled up a little higher. So if there was something down here, it would make sense that it would be banging the bottom of the floor. So let's go down there and see if there, we can find anything that's out of the ordinary. This is pretty crazy, guys. I don't know. Oh, ouch. Oh, man. What was that? Ow. I just hit my elbow on something. Oh, whoa. What is that? Carl, there is something metal sticking out of this of the ground down here. What? It looks kind of like a pipe, but I can just see the edge of it. This looks like it goes really deep in the ground. Whoa. What? Man, look at that. It looks like welded together. This looks like it came from like some, like an alien planet. I don't even know. This does not look like anything I've seen before. Whoa, okay. Okay, okay, okay. I got it out of the ground. Okay, can you bring it back to the hatch? Yeah, I'll come up there. It's not too heavy. That is really weird. Okay, let's take this up and see if we can get it open or figure out what it is. What does it look like, Ginger? Oh man, check this out. Whoa, what the heck? Have you ever seen anything like that before? What in the world? That is not what I thought you had down there. Isn't that, that is crazy? really interesting. Oh my gosh. What do you think that is? I have no idea. Look, it's like something is, was oozing out of it. We better take this in the kitchen and we'll see if we can get it open or figure out what this is. You guys, check this out. This is what, what mom found <gasps> down in there. That's weird. I don't want you guys to touch it, but yeah. let's take it to the kitchen counter and we'll see what's inside. Okay, we have the canister in the kitchen here. I have no idea what is inside <laughs> that thing. Yeah. What do you guys think is in there? I have no idea what's gonna be in there. Maybe it's like rotten soup or something. Maybe oh, it's like yeah. one of the guys that built this place. Like one of the construction workers left like his canteen down there left or something. His lunch. His I don't lunch. know. I don't think that that's what it is. That's pretty weird looking to me. Well, I've got some safety goggles on. Why don't you guys back up over there a little bit? Okay. Because we really don't know what this is. It doesn't make a, any sound or anything, which is kind of weird. That would lead me to think that it's like empty, but no, I would say it maybe only weighs like a pound and a half, maybe two pounds. What does it smell like? like burnt chemicals oh, but that's really what's careful. weird i don't understand what this oozing stuff is right yeah that's like, the weird thing listen to that that does sound hollow it's like some kind of a hollow container try just try to open it first okay oh man does, does it twist it the other way that's exactly what i was gonna ask give me a second <laughs> There's no way that's gonna twist Whoa. open. It, like it might go the other way. Like, what if it goes the other way? Ready? Is it like welded shut or something? <sighs> I don't know. Yeah, I mean, this might be like an epoxy, like a glue or something. Whatever is in here, it's like they don't want it to be, get found, but look at it. It looks like it's like been burnt. Like, almost like something re entered the atmosphere. I don't know. Let's rinse it off and see. Whoa! Wow, that's a way different color than I expected now that we're getting the dirt off of this. On the lid right here, did you see that? It's like all like... It's dented. 
Like that has been like, through some stuff. Like it looks like it went That must dark. be like a thousand years old. I don't know. I don't what do you know. think? Tell us down in the comments below. What do you think this is? What's really strange is that we hear banging in the basement under the crawl space and you go down in there and this is what you find. I feel like there were like footprints down there, lots of handprints, and I don't think they were gauges. Oh my gosh. Come what, on what? Carl, you're the strongest one in the family. <laughs> It is not budging at all. It's hard. Look, I got a dent in it. Oh, whoa! That was weird. Whoa! Yeah. Will you go get a hammer gauge? Yeah. Well, I don't want to hurt the countertop either. That's wrong. Oh. Kind of dented. Okay. I think I would have to hit it a lot harder than that. Let's go outside and we'll throw it up in the air and stuff, and we'll see. Maybe we'll drop it from something up high. Okay. That's a good idea. We're gonna real scientific here. We're gonna find out what's in this weird time capsule pod thing. It's a real mystery. You ready? All right, here we go. Two, one, go! Whoa! What happened? You know what happened? I ran faster than I've ran in a while. That's what happened. Wait. Totally dented in the bottom. I got an idea. Let's drive over top of it with the car. Yeah. Okay. Let's okay. do that. Okay. Who, who doesn't do that. want to try that? We should totally do it. <laughs> All right, Ginger, are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready, girl. I've, I've got the uh, canister or time capsule thing right here. We're going to put it right here under the tire. Three, two, one. Go slow. Whoa. Oh, go easy. Okay, go. Okay, that's crazy. You back up a little bit. Back up. Ooh, look at that, you guys. It's totally dented in. But it didn't get crushed by the car. Can you believe that? Whoa! It survived getting wow. run over by the car. Look, you guys. It totally scraped on the pavement. It just like dragged underneath the tire all the way. It almost popped the car tire. Look, the bottom is coming off. Can you see inside of it? Oh my gosh. I think it's hollow in there, guys. It totally flattened here. And look, this whole part, whether this is the lid or the bottom, I don't know. Whoa. But it's all the way off. Look. Whoa. <gasps> what is that? Whoa, what, what is that? What is that? There's like an inner cylinder here. Hold that. Be very careful. Okay, we what? don't know what that is. Okay, back up. Is this like a button? It's totally Jeez. smashed. Oh man, this is not budging at all. Should we try and drive over it some more? Yeah. That was working pretty good. Yeah. Let's stick it back under the tire and we'll try one more time. Three, two, one, go. Careful, careful, careful. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, let's, we better stop. Back up. That is not going to do it. We tried to run over this thing with the car twice and for some reason it won't open. So I think we need to go back in the house and see if we can pop this thing wide open with some tools. There's only one way left I can think of to get this open. We can keep smashing it. I don't know what this button is or if there's something inside there. So I think our best case scenario here is to just use this saw and cut it wide open. You guys ready? Three, two, one. Definitely metal. This thing is way tougher than it looks. So I'm just gonna try and pry it open, but it's oh. like there's another inner cylinder inside. Oh, you can totally see it. Oh my goodness, oh, look at crazy. this. Crazy. Whoa. Oh, Stand back. I don't know I don't what know is going on. There. How are we gonna get this open? I don't know, I'm sweating like crazy. I've been fighting this thing for like forever, and it's like there's layer upon layer. I think this is a pretty decent way to open it. I've just got to get a good grip on it. Look yeah. at this. I can get this open. I'm like peeling this stuff off. But then that's like a black layer. I know. And then there's copper inside of that. Right? That it's is like so weird. Like onion. There's this layer upon layer of stuff on this thing. Arrgh. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, that's weird. Okay. There's a red button on this thing. And there's a black Look, button on the other side. There's a black button on this side and a red button on this side. Oh. And I just miss it with the grinder. What does it do? It's a button. If I push it, it moves. I don't know if I should be pushing this, but look guys, this is coming off now. I think I'm Whoa. in. <gasps> look. Oh man, you got it. I got it. I'm trying to work around the buttons here. Listen. Wait, there's Whoa. something in There's that. something loose inside there actually now. Look, I got the top off. Here's the button mechanism. Oh, that's crazy. It's not even hooked up to anything. Okay. Oh, oh, it's open, it's open, it's open. Look, it's been threaded. 
And look, there's like an outer shell and an inner shell. Is there anything inside? What is that? What? What is this? What is this is not what I expected at all. Wait, it's a cassette tape. <gasps> it's a cassette tape, you guys. No way. Is there anything else inside this? No, it looks like, any, like brand new in there, but all burnt and weird on the outside. This thing looks like it's been recorded like all the way through. There's an old cassette tape. Who has any idea what in the world is recorded on this? Why it would be put in this container and buried in our basement? But well, I don't even think we own any kind of like a cassette player like this. This is yeah. really old, right? You know what? I might have one from when I was a little kid. Really? What? Yeah. No I way. I think I might have an old cassette player. Like still in your stuff? Yes. Well, maybe what we'll have to do is we'll save that for another video or maybe you can do that for your channel. But this is a good stopping point here. I think yeah. this is good enough for today. We figured out what was inside the container. We explored down in the crawl space. If you like this video and you want to find out more and figure out what's on this, go check out the Gingerific channel. In the meantime, we've handpicked these other videos in order for you to watch and check more. If you like this one, you're going to love these. Make sure and subscribe and turn on notifications and we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye. Do you think it's recorded on here? I don't know. Maybe it's music or maybe it's another clue. Yeah. I don't know.